this is Mark, Kilo Mike 6, Zulu Papa Oscar, demonstrating a Yesu FT710 um, running Vara HF. And I'll show you these settings after I do the message receive. So I sent myself a message, and I'm going to use a, a gateway uh, which is 94 kilometers away. Uh, Whiskey 6 Bravo, Bravo India. Um, and we'll just go ahead and hit start. Let's see. I'll turn it up so you can hear it. It's transmitting. By the way, 15 watts. 1 5 watts. Try one more time. We got a little bit of traffic on nearby. That sounds good. It's doing its little, hey, let's see how how well we can do this. Handshake. Send it, send it uh, receiving. Okay, and that's done. Almost. Okay, all done. And now let me turn down the volume over here and I'll go into my inbox. Oh, did it not come in? Yeah, here it is. Yeah, this is the one I just sent, showing me sending me a message. Okay, so how did I do this? Uh, first of all, the radio is in uh, data data mode, data upper for um, you know I'm not sure <laughs> if you can even make it data lower. It's um, that's that's a good question data upper can you go data lower well there you go maybe I should have been down there but you know what it, it worked well no look at that you go data lower and it's still data upper there's something about Winlink it just won't go to data lower sideband <clears throat> but for some reason it works so for this station the dial frequency is 7102.1 and over here it's saying 7102.130 That's strange. Let's go ahead and reselect it. Maybe I touched the dial. 7102.1. Yeah, yeah, I just hit the dial accidentally. But <clears throat> it was correct. Okay, but the important stuff is up here in the radio settings. So this is how I have it. For a FT710, I'm using the Yesu FT991 digital mode. COM11 is my COM. There's 10 and 11. 11 worked. Uh, it has to be 38400 as the BOD, otherwise it won't work. Uh, both of these have to be checked. And then serial port, you're going to use FT991. That should work. Uh, once you've done that, to confirm um, that it's working, two things. First, you confirm that it can select a channel. So I'll just pick this one. Uh, now it should be 7105, and it is. Okay, so that's the first thing. Um, the second thing you want to test is, is it talking to the radio and is it the correct um, ALC, so the drive level. And um, the way that you test that is, is first, you know, it's simple to just say, you know, is it transmitting? Yes, it's transmitting. That confirms the connection is good. But what, but what you want to do here is 
you want to confirm the ALC is in a, an acceptable range. So you're going to click this, whatever the, whatever it happens to be for, for you now, like you might have it on SWR mode, right? So you want to click ALC and then you can see it. So then when I click tune over here, I can see it's registering, you know, around three. Uh, and that's kind of where you want it to be, okay? Any higher than that, you might, you know, might over deviate. Uh, any lower than that, and um, they may not even hear you. But anyways, 15 watts um, was sufficient to to run 94 kilometers. And this is... going over a set of several mountain ranges between me and that station. Because um, I'm out here in the Anza Borrego Desert. So... Uh, you're going, you know, over the Santa Rosa Mountains. You're going over the San Jacinto, Santa Ana, and then all the way across Orange County and Los Angeles. You know, it's a it's a considerable distance away um, over a, a lot of terrain. And I'm working it on 40 meters tonight, <clears throat> which works well. So if you've been wondering how to get the FT710 working uh, with Winlink Vara, uh, that works. Anyway, KM6, ZPO out.